Yo, 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 it's D Arthur in the building. I'm talking to you guys today about retention and aura that can't be faked. Semen retention is an aura that can't be faked because once you're once you once you've been on it for at least like two weeks, at least two weeks, you're gonna be you're gonna be connecting on all cylinders. Everything that you that you do is going to be precise. You're going to be fully present and you're going to do everything with efficiency and people are going to start looking at you like you're a very, you might even be a mad man. Who is this person who just walks with so much enthusiasm and who is so just joyful with life? This holds weight. People find this attractive. People find you as the person to go to. You're the go-to man when it comes to things. Your, your opinion holds the most weight. You're becoming someone who who can you're becoming a consultant <laughs> you're becoming a consultant you can be someone who can people will may even pay you for your opinion this is how powerful you can become this is you have th this is the powers that you can get when you go on retention the ability to the ability to have the insights of your highest version the ability to explain things in a very precise way. Meditation plus retention is, like I said, is the cheat code. You you meditate, your mind is clear, and now all of the things that you say are very hit home. They stick, they hold weight. And like I said, when you go on retention, when you this aura can't be faked. When you go on, when you when you're relapsing consistently you you might think you might act like oh nothing is wrong blah 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 but actually everything is wrong you can't fake confidence you can't fake it i mean you may be able to but the thing is it just it just it just it seems a little off if you've been relapsing consistently and and then you want to you just seem like you're a little bit off when you've been relapsing consistently you can i mean you can act you can act as precise as you want, but people can tell. You even can tell yourself there's just a little bit difference in how you act. You might say the same words with the same tonality. You might say the same things the same way, but it just it just doesn't hit as home. Um, once you retain, everything becomes aligned. Your everything starts becoming aligned. Your whole world is your reality is somewhat some something that you can. Uh, be happy with everything starts falling into place but like i said if you're living in a lower vibration and you're consistently relapsing consistently um you're just not going to be as happy as possible and then once you're not a, you're not as happy as possible you're you're going to start seeing thing, other things in your life um not be as the best as they can be so i mean like i said semen retention an aura can't be faked an aura can't be faked and or it can't be faked like the thing is like <laughs> like people like like i said once like i said once you go on retention once you become start once your your habits are becoming better um and you're just getting better every day like i said people start noticing this about you and then all of a sudden people want to want to become nice to you people want to be want to want to want to talk to you and and share ideas with you but like i said you should only really be operating with people who are in similar wavelengths as you, who who talk about the same thing, who are similar in mind than you, because it's easy to get stuck in somebody else's reality. One person says says something, and then all of a sudden you think it's true, but just because they said it, it may not necessarily be true. And if you keep hearing the same thing over and over again, you your subconscious may eventually believe it. This is why subliminal affirmations are important. This is why it's important to change your self-talk because once you start hearing things on a repetitive basis over and over again, it just means that, like I said, your subconscious is accepting it. And then once your subconscious accepts something, it make it will do its, its duty to make it manifest. It has to, your subconscious beliefs are your reality. So like I said, believe the best is for you. Don't take in the mediocre beliefs beliefs the the highest beliefs as possible belief enhancing talk and then watch it marinate in your reality semen retention this aura cannot be faked 
this is this is the top 0.001 percent of of aura and attitude that you can start delivering to the world like i said your attitude is the most important thing once you have a good and and happy attitude you don't let bs falter you you let you don't let people who who act one way one day and then act a whole different way the next day phase you you're aligned you're you're becoming enlightened you're becoming you're becoming maybe even a juggernaut because you don't let small things hinder you your your eyes is on the prize 24 7 you're always on the go your your eyes is on the prize and you're always on the go so like i say you don't let small small things or small-minded people hinder you you're becoming your best expression this is the best thing you can do for yourself because once you become your full and most authentic expression um the world may be aligned the world will finally be aligned you can live in complete harmony iron sharpens iron you only you only correlate with people who want similar wavelengths as you semen retention your aura cannot be faked you can tell people who are who are half in with success people who want to be successful one day and then want to be want to be normal the, the next day you can tell the type of people people you start you might even start realizing you start seeing something that may be sophisticated and maybe something a successful person would say and then someone agrees with you and then the next day they say they're gonna do it and then they don't even do it anymore you see my retention the aura can't be fake it's either you're with the people who want to who want to do this and be successful and you're you're with the people who don't want who just want to sometimes be successful and sometimes just kid around and not take things that seriously but, i mean the thing is like it's it's okay to take not always be uptight but i mean there has you have to know what you really want and i mean if you really want it you have to be pr pretty serious about getting something that you want and then i mean once you get the thing that you want then know and then you you can i guess you can quote unquote chill and be who be whatever you want to be but business is business things happen you want things you you have to think about things the things that you really want must be put in extreme importance and extreme priority and other things that are not as important must be put on the back burner until you really get the things that you want because then once you get the things that you really want all other things like i said will fall into place it's either you want it or you make excuses you either want it or you make excuses you can tell like i said you can tell the people who really want something and are not going to make any excuses to get it and the people who will who say they want something and then they're going to make all of the excuses as to why they can't do it you have the power to create you're an authentic you're a high vibrational being you're authentic and high vibrational you can get the things that you want you can become who you want to be you can live the life that you really want to be people say people have this this a pass on belief that life is hard and sure yes life can be hard but what are you focused on in order to try to make your life as smoothly as possible i mean you're just gonna take you're just gonna take that life is hard and not really do anything about it you're gonna conform you're not gonna read anything else you're not gonna apply anything different you're gonna just look at things as they are and don't realize that you have the power to change it or you're really gonna do something about it it's up to you it's it's about how how passionate can you go all in how how can you go all in into something and finally get the results that you've always wanted because like i said once you get the results that you've always wanted you're gonna be happy and then the world is gonna be a happier place because you're gonna be lighter on your feet but don't be don't be worried about not getting it being worried about not getting is a signal to the world to the most high that you're not you don't have any faith on getting the things that you want on becoming who you want to be <sighs> and that is tragic <clears throat> so yes see retention this aura can't be faked like i said you either want success or you're gonna make excuses about why you don't have success the choice is up to you what are you really serious about what do you really want what are you all in about like i said there's people who talk about success some days and then the next days they don't even know what success is it's about because motivation because um commitment attracts success not interest People can be interested about certain things and say they can be hoopla all day about certain things. But when it comes to whether they feel or like they feel like it or they don't feel like it, then they won't do it. 
commitment equals success. And with that being said, I'm out. Like, comment, and subscribe below. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.